the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will soon have their own household to show their growing roles as senior members of the royal family. The move away from sharing households with Prince William and Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge sees their backroom staff split. It may also mean a change in direction for their public work as William and Kate prepare to become the Prince and Princess of Wales one day before ascending the throne as future King and Queen. Royal split, Meghan Markle and Kate will have separate royal offices Meghan Markle not close enough to take baby advice from Kate, where will Meghan and Harry's new royal household be? The Duke and Duchess of Sussex will have their office based at Buckingham Palace instead of Kensington Palace, where Kate and William's staff will be located. The move will likely not take place until after the birth of their first baby, which is due around April time. Despite the split, the Sussexes and Cambridges remain united in their work at the Royal Foundation their main charitable body. Read more, Meghan Markle smiles as Prince Harry B.U.R.S.T.S. into song The four could still work on larger projects such as their mental health campaign, Heads Together. Meghan and Harry have chosen a new member of staff to take on the role of their head of communications in Sarah Latham. Ms. Latham is a public relations heavyweight and former senior advisor on Hillary Clinton's 2016 U.S. presidential campaign. She also worked in the White House under Bill Clinton in the late 1990s when he was American president and was special advisor to the late Dame Tessa Jowell during her stints as culture secretary. Meghan Markle officially on maternity leave as Duchess due date just. Kate Middleton bombshell, how Harry revealed secret on wedding day Buckingham Palace announced the split in households in a statement, the Queen has agreed to the creation of a new household for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, following their marriage in May last year. The household, which will be created with the support of the Queen and the Prince of Wales, will be established in the spring. The Duke of Sussex currently has his own private office, which has been supporting the Duchess since their Royal Highness's engagement in November 2017. This long-planned move will ensure that permanent support arrangements for the Duke and Duchess's work are in place as they start their family and move to their official residence at Frogmore Cottage. Senior royals often separate into different households as it paves the way for their own staff and aides, and the chance to pursue different goals, Princes William and Harry separated from their father the Prince of Wales household when they came of age, which was always expected. The Sussexes and Cambridge's current communications head Jason Knopf will stay with William and Kate becoming their senior advisor. His responsibilities will include advising on charitable initiatives which includes work on the environment, mental health, and early childhood. It also involves supporting a review of the charitable structures that underpin their work. 